when you're a progressive in Texas, if you couldn't laugh about things, you weren't gonna last. Molly was the source of all information about how to understand and to kind of put into some kind of context the stupidity uh, of politics in Texas. When I first started writing about these bozos, and I'd say something in the Texas Observer like, you know, representative so-and-so, runs on all fours and has the IQ of an adolescent pissant. And uh, I'd wait for him to come by with a horse whip, and all that ever happened was I'd see him in the Capitol the next day, and they'd say, baby, you put my name in your paper. She had a sense of humor that would keep you from being angry at her very long because she would take that pen and stick in you and, and make you realize that you were taking yourself way too seriously. And many times you didn't know what the heck you were talking about, and Molly did. I think of my time at the Texas Observer the way some people think of their college years, as, as just this happy, golden, sunshine-filled, beer-drenched. <laughs> wonderful, wonderful time. Having more fun than the law allows. 